My name is Eli Walker and I'm a yoga instructor at the Atmananda Yoga Sequence Studio in Manhattan and I'm here today to show you a few basic poses that will help you use your Atmananda Yoga mat today. Starting in Tadasana, right at the top of the mat, my feet are behind the first line and outside the parallel lines. The parallel lines are three to four inches apart which ensures that your feet are hips width apart. Coming into downward facing dog or plank pose, your hands go on the handprints right behind the first line, and the feet are in the X boxes. For standing poses like Warrior 1 or Warrior 2, you can bring your foot up right behind the first line and right outside the parallel line. For Warrior 1, hop your back foot up to the 45 degree angle line, toes on the orange triangle, and simply raise your arms up. For Warrior 2, you can simply bring your left heel forward about 2 inches, and then toe heel your left foot behind the fourth line so it's 90 degrees and bend the right knee more. The center line, the middle line, is obviously used to help keep your body centered throughout your practice. You use the purple circle for poses like high lunge to give your body a little bit more stability and balance. From here, you can also Use the second line, which is eight inches behind each hand, for poses like Bakasana. For more information, you can check out our website at www.atmananda.com or feel free to shoot us an email at manager at We hope you enjoy your new Atmananda yoga mat. Namaste.